Hello world, this is Chiraj. Welcome to this channel. In our last video, we discussed how we can set up the flow plans. In this video, I am going to explain how we can print price text on Aronium point of sale system. Most of my audience requested and asked questions on how we can print price text with including the exact barcode appeared on the product list. So, let's get started. I am going to start the Aronium point of sale system software and give my password and get into the software. First we can go to the menu, then we can come to the management, then we can click on the products. And the products you can see all the details. Here you can see the product code, name, group, barcode, cost and other details. So the main objective of this video, how we can print price text including the exact barcode appeared here. So, so for example, if I search a particular product, the watch, Apple Watch Series 8, the product barcode is here. So we want to print this particular barcode on the price text. So let's see how we can do this. You don't want to search this product here, or you don't want to uh, search the product and you don't want to start from here. Directly you can click the products and directly you can go to the next step. You can click the price text. Once you click the price text, you will be getting this dialog box. On the left side, you can see the layout. On the right side, you can see the print preview. You can adjust the print preview at the last here. At the bottom of this layout, you can see print preview. And you can click this print preview and you can see the real view how you are going to get your price text. The layout, you can see the paper size is A4 paper width height and the margin to all of the four sides columns, label width and height and under the display we have product name, price, code, barcode, borders and main one we have barcode type, product name, price, price size, uh, barcode height and products. So you can see in the preview, you can see the price text for all the products which have the stocks. Okay, So you can see it about seven pages. So we don't want to print price text to all the products, we are going to print the price text only for a particular product. I'm going to print the price text for the same product, Apple Watch Series 8. So we'll search watch or you can give either uh, the product code or barcode, whatever the detail you can give and search the product. So here you can see Apple Watch Series 8, you can click here, then there you have. So again, you can click the print preview and you can see the preview. So here we have the name of the product, price of the product, and the barcode. And here we have the code of the product, 1042. So let's uh, uh, see how we can customize this uh, price text on this A4 sheet. Then we can discuss about the barcode issue. So here we have the A4 sheet, this sheet having uh, this particular width and 297 height. So we want to print 24 price text. So let's assume we have 24 stocks on this particular product. So we want to print 24 price text. So I'm going to uh, print 24 by uh, making the six rows and four columns. Okay, six rows and four columns. So I'm going to get the calculator here. So let's search and get the calculator. And here we have the calculator and we know the paper width is 210. So we'll type 210 and divide this 210 by 4 right? because we need to have 4 columns. So the answer is 52.5. So you can enter this 52.5 in the label width. The label width, we can enter 52.5. Like that, we can take this uh, 297, the height of the sheet, 297, divided by 6, because we need 6 rows, and the answer is 49.5. I'm going to enter this 49.5 in the label height, 49.5. And we can do one more setting. You can come all the way down. Here you can see number of copies. I'm going to enter 24. 24. You can use the incremental and decremental button also, or you can directly enter 24 number. And you can click on the print preview. Here you can see we have four columns 
and six rows so exactly we can get 24 copies of this price tag so here you can see the price tag is almost uh, square uh, i don't want to print this uh, in square and i want to get this in rectangle here you can see the layout is six by four and totally we have 24 copies and it's almost uh, like square i don't want the square price tags and i need to have in rectangle so let's see how we can uh, reverse this option here we have uh, six by four and almost we have exactly we have 24 and i want to get this in uh, 24 in other way eight by three so then we can get in a rectangle eight by three so let's see how we can adjust this one so let's take the calculator again and take this uh, paper width 210 and this width is going to be divided by four this time so we need to have uh, not four three correction uh, three so we need to divide by uh, three so the answer is 70 and we are going to give this label width is 70 exactly 70 uh, we need to have uh, three uh, columns okay like that we'll call the calculator again and let's take the 297 the paper height and divide by eight we need to have eight rows this time and the answer is 37.125 so we can enter the 37.125 here that's fine now you can click the print preview we need to have 24 copies and you can click the print preview and here you can see three columns and eight rows eight rows so we have 24 here so now you can get in rectangle so that's fine now i got my rectangle price tags that's pretty easy so now we'll come to the major idea major point of this video here you can see the price tags here you can see the price tags name is okay price is okay and the product id is okay the problem is here we have the barcode the barcode of the particular product is here we can see the barcode starting with 2 and ending with 64 but here we got the different number so let's see how we can correct this one to correct this one you don't want to do any big setting here we have the barcode type barcode type is by default ean8 or oh, this may be my previous setting so you have to click this combo and we can change this one so for example if we give this ean13 and click the print preview and you can see the barcode something like this so here we have uh, 64 that is our actual or the real barcode but we got 60 that also uh, something like different type of barcode but it will be a uh, different type of barcode so to correct this one you can click this barcode type and here you can select the interleave 2 of 5 itf okay so i'm going to click this one and click on the print preview now you can see the exact barcode appeared on our product list here starting with 201 double two five one three two three five six four exactly same appeared on our product list once you complete all these settings you can directly you can print or you can save this as pdf file or word or xml file so that is up to you for the time being let's uh, print using the pdf printer then we'll will give a number uh, watch 1042 24 price text then we'll click the save button then we'll open this pdf file here we have the uh, pdf file you can print this pdf file or you can do it some of the other way so that's all i want to discuss in this video if you love this video hit the thumbs up button if you are new to this channel click the subscribe button and don't forget to click the ring bell then you'll be getting to my brand new videos thank you very much guys we'll meet in the next video goodbye for now